Look at the two balls in this picture. One of them is released and falls directly down, and the other one, at the exact same time, is tossed sideways. Which one do you think will hit the ground first? We're going to do an experiment using something called the free fall flicker to answer that question. We'll use two pennies. One of them will get pushed sideways, and at the exact same time, another penny will be dropped downward. Here's how to make one. Supplies you'll need are masking tape, a 3x5 index card, and a craft stick or popsicle stick. To make the free fall flicker, start by folding the index card in half the long way, or hot dog way. Then fold again. and fold again so that you're making a W-shaped piece of paper. Looking at the end, you should see a W cross-section. Next, take some tape and tape over the end. Then take the popsicle stick and stick it in so that it's about halfway inside the center groove and halfway out. Then tape it securely. That's it. Now you've got your free fall flicker. To use the free fall flicker, pinch the end of the popsicle stick in one hand and put the flicker so that it hangs out over the edge of a table and put two pennies on the very end. Then take your index finger and grab the very end of the free fall flicker and pull it back towards you and flick it to release it and fling the pennies. The key is to make it so that the falling penny and the sideways penny are both released at the same time. Set up the free fall flicker in a room that has a hard floor and then listen as the two pennies hit the ground and see if you can hear which one lands first, the falling penny or the sideways penny. 